Hey everyone, Brandon here from Idaho Hockey, joined with Ken Cashman, who is the director of apparel for Bauer Hockey, who's going to give us an in-depth look at the core short base layer and jock line. So before we get into the unique tech and spec of each model, you know, what is that core short uh, really designed for? Like, who are, who's the player it's designed for? And kind of like, what are the differences between uh, the one, two, and three? Sure, sure. Let me walk you through them all, Brandon. So, hey, to start off, core short's a partnership with a, with a group the, the core short group that uh, has developed a short for some time and really got it to where it is today. And it's, it's exercise physiologists and coaches and they put a lot of time into this and they understand the anatomy of the body. So this is the very first one they've developed, which is our core three. And what core three is, it's, it's really, really high compression. This is 80% more compression than the Bauer Pro compression short we had in the past, right? But the real key to this is this X design. Right? This ex your body doesn't move unilaterally, right? Your right hip is connected to your left leg and, and, and vice versa. So this X connects that. It's that connectivity to your leg to your hip. So it gives you a little bit more performance. Also, with this X design, with this higher back and with this heavy compression, it's really stable. So stability and mobility is really what we're looking at here. Now this was designed with such high compression, it was for players that had a groin injury that wanted to get back on the ice. So it was really a rehab short. Okay. So that was the first short they developed and we have it in our line as it was, right? Uh, when you talk about just starting out though, the next short they made was, was Core 1. So they took that same technology and they brought it down. This is 40% more compression than our old Bauer base layer short. So still a lot more compression than we had before, but something comfortable that you could train in, you could wear for a long period of time. And it's not just for when you've had an injury coming okay. off. So still the X design, uh, not as extreme. You can see on the elastic as the other one and a really comfortable short, but again, really holding you in and keeping you stable. Now players were like, hey, you know, it was great when I had an injury with, with, with Core 3. I didn't want to wear that all the time. Core One's a little too less, uh, not, I'm not seeing as much performance benefit. Do you have something in between? So the newest one that we developed was Core 2.0. And this has 60% uh, more uh, compression than the old Bauer uh, base layer short. So it's right in between there. Okay. So you can feel, and you can see it's, it's back to that more extreme elastic X design. So you get a lot of those same benefits without being so dramatically uh, compressive as the core three. So again, starting out core one would probably be the best place for someone to start. And because of that, when you look at integrating a jock, Brandon, like, you mm -hmm. know, the two and three would be very uncomfortable. Right. <laughs> integrated the jock. Too much there. compression. Too much compression. You'd just wear a, a mesh jock short over it. Right. But core one, uh, although it's more compressive, still would allow you to integrate a jock and be comfortable. So we did that in a jock short, and we also developed a jock pant. So we no longer have the you know pro lock jock mm -hmm. uh, pant and short that you saw in our new line. That would now you would go into the pro here, okay. uh, the core here for that. Right on. So that one really designed for somebody getting into maybe even a compression short, really good for hockey and training. Two, you got that extra compression. So for somebody who wants extra stabilization, and that three almost mainly for a rehab kind of training. For sure, yeah, I yeah. think you hit it right on the head. I mean, I think most of your, you know, core one is gonna be the one that's most uh, comfortable and most what people are most used to. Okay. But that person trying to get to that next level and even more of a performance edge would jump yep. right into two. And again, if you've had a history of pelvic or hip or groin injury, yep. jump right into the three. Right on. Well, thank you so much for taking us through that quarter to short line. Thanks, Brandon. And then for you at home, if you want more information or to get your hands on one of these core short base layer jocks, you can head over to Ice Warehouse dot com.